Hello and welcome to the Minutes Within the Mist, where we travel through the forests of Washington to bring you stories about cryptids, ghosts, and other mysteries. Today, we'll talk about in the encounter at Ape Canyon. In a narrow gorge on the east flank of Mount St. Helens is what is now called Ape Canyon. It was on a summer night in July of 1924 that a small cabin housing a group of gold miners came under attack by a gang of wild ape men. The five men described coming upon gorilla men near where they had built a small cabin eight miles from Spirit Lake. The miners were asleep when the attack started. Out of nowhere, the cabin they had hand-built was being hit by huge stones. They were being thrown by mountain devils on all sides. Four giant animals moved through the forest with erect, human-like strides. They were covered in long black hair and had ears about four inches long sticking straight up. The creatures also possessed four toes, short and stubby. The witnesses estimated that each animal had to weigh at least 400 pounds. Taken aback at the sight of the huge beast, one of the miners, Fred Beck, fired his rifle at one of the creatures and struck it three times before the wounded animal toppled off of a cliff. The attack ceased only to start back again a few minutes later. At one point, one of the Sasquatches reached into the cabin through a hole in the construction. It took hold of an ax, but before he could pull it out of again, he was stopped. They heard and felt giant bodies slamming against the walls and doors. The ape men were seeking revenge and the beast eventually tore a hole in the roof, allowing them to target Beck. The siege continued until daybreak, which prompted the animals to break off their attack and slip away. The men poked their head out of the door, and when they decided that the coast was clear, ran out of the woods. The site of the actual cabin is unknown, but people still make the hike to Eight Canyon. I hope you enjoyed the story of the encounter at Ape Canyon, and we'll tell your friends about us for cryptids, ghosts, and other mysteries. But until then, be careful who you upset, and remain constantly curious.